Hey folks, what's up? This is Amazing Animal Adventures, back again. So today I've got this beautiful um, forest wolf spider, and I'm going to be feeding it a cricket. Right here, it's a small one. Um, it's not like a giant spider. I mean, it's pretty big for its size, for its species, but it's not as big as it looks in the photo. Put the cricket in right now. Oh, boom. Immediately. I grabbed it as soon as it hit the bottom. He is just a dead serious hunter. You can see it there grasping the cricket. It's jaws. At this point, he's probably injecting the venom, which paralyzes it. And also, um, vomiting this digestive fluid on it, which will start digesting the cricket because spiders can only eat fluids they can't eat meat so they need to turn as much of the insect into fluids as they can You can see the cricket's still moving, but it's slowing down. Spider's tearing pretty deep into it. Oh, look at that right there, you can see. Bang. A little bit. Like I said, this was a full forest wolf hunter, so these guys are hunters. They don't spin webs. So that's what they do all their life. There's the thing right there. Oh man, that's a great shot. Man, it's pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna turn off the camera for a moment, let some time pass, because it's always a pretty long process with these guys. Okay, a little bit of time has passed, guys, and Cricket's still barely moving, but the spider's kind of getting deeper into him at this point. It's harder to see the Cricket because more of him is stuck in the spider's jaws. Let's see if I can get you head on view. Oh, there we go. That's a good shot right there. And you can see the spider's eyes and stuff. Cricket's there. Cricket's pretty much stopped struggling at this point. Wow. That's an awesome shot right there. Oh yeah, you can totally see the fangs, they're digging into it. Oh, and there's the cricket's guts, it's been broken in half. You can see it, his digestive fluids have started turning the, his in, the cricket's insides into liquid. Yeah, I don't think that hurt gets alive anymore.
and that the fangs are getting into the head now, injecting the fluid into there to start turning the hard, crusty parts of the head into more liquid so the spider can drink more of it. Now, this point of view on the spider's head, you can see six, almost seven of his five eye, of his eight eyes, sorry. There's the two main ones, which are the most viewable. Under each of those, you'll see two smaller ones. And behind the one on the right, you'll see one on top, which is kind of showing behind. This gives the spider a panoramic view, because it's got eyes that are almost facing backwards. You can see the juice is coming out of the head at this point. Oh man. Okay, so more time has passed and the spider has moved on to the abdomen of the cricket where it's more juicy and stuff. You can see those huge jaws just continually getting into it, seeing, getting everything it can out of this cricket, turning it as much of it as it can into liquid. You can just see how juicy it is right there. And you can see those, a bunch of the front legs, the two front leg thingies. They're actually not legs, but um, they're, I can't remember the name, but they help with feeding. They're not, they're not used for walking. They're used to hold the prey while the jaws work their magic. That's a really good view of the spider's eyes right there. See them really clearly in this light. Oh man, so juicy. Yeah, I'm going to give it a stop, and I'll um, get back on after a little bit more time has passed. So, more time has passed, and yeah, the cricket just looks like a mashed up glob now. It doesn't really look like a cricket anymore. Yeah. Well, I think that just about sums up for today. That was a pretty cool thing to watch. Thank you for watching. Once again, this is the Forest Wolf Spider, and this is Amazing Animal Adventures. Out.